Hello, hope you're doing good. In this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to add time limit in Google Form Quiz. The first thing you will need to do once on Google Forms, you're going to go over to the top right hand corner and you're going to tap on the three dots that says more. After you have done that, you're going to tap on get add-ons. After selecting get add-ons, I want you to tap on the search bar and you're going to simply type in time. After you have done that, you can see numerous timer options that you can choose from. The option that we'll be using for this example is form timer limit. So you're going to tap right there. Then you're going to be selecting this option right here, form limit timer, and you're going to tap on install. After you have tapped on install, you're going to be prompt to sign in and you can quickly sign in and then tap on continue and allow. Once you have done that, you'll be redirected to Google Forms. Once you're on Google Forms once more, you can tap on done. Then we'll tap on X to close out. Now that we have done that, you could add in your question. So let's say for example, my question is what day is today? So I'll type that in right there. For example, sake. after you have done that, you can tap on all right there. And then I'm going to be setting the timer now. To set the timer, all I will need to do is tap on the extension option from the top right hand corner of the navigation bar. So you can see it right here. You will tap on add ons. Then you are going to select the add ons. After you have done that, you are going to tap on configure. Once you have tapped on configure, you are going to see it pop up on the right hand column. Once it has popped up, all you will need to do now is enter the time and the date that you would like it to start. So for example, I'm going to tap on start form. After you have selected start form, let's say I will be sharing it today. So I'll select today's date. Then from here, you can select the time that you will be sharing it. So let's say six. So I'll say six o'clock on the dot. After you have done that, you're going to tap on stop form and I'm going to be stopping it. So let's say I will be stopping it at 6.15. I would select 615 right there. After you have done that, you can scroll down and they have other options also. So you have the form limit and you have other options. You can choose whether you like them to sign in to submit. Once everything is there liking, you're going to tap on save. After tapping on save, you're going to give it a few seconds. Then you're going to see the option to preview it. So you can see right there, it is now saving our information. So if we were to tap right here and preview it, you can see how it looks and you can see that the timer is counting down because it is soon, it will soon be 6 a.m. Once it reaches 6 a.m., they'll be able to access the form and then it will give them the 15 minutes that I had set to answer the form. And that's it. Hope you found this tutorial helpful and informative. If you did, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe.